everybody and welcome back to yet another review. Today we're going to be taking a look at Kevin Shiftright from the 2020 Blue Desert Dynaco 400 series. Of course a re-release of the Clutch Aid Racer. So let's get started with the review. Really not much to say about this guy. He's the Clutch Aid Racer from the first Cars movie. I don't have many of the Piston Cup cars from the first movie. So I'm really glad that um, the Blue Desert series has re-released so many of them for me to finally be able to add to my collection. And of course today we have Kevin Shift Right, not to be confused with the other Kevin in the Piston Cup, Kevin Racing Tire, who is sponsored by Shifty Drug, always making me think that he is Kevin Shift Right. Because when I think of a Kevin with Shift in his name, I think Shifty Drug. It's kind of annoying, but this is Kevin Shift Right. The other one is Kevin Racing Tire. Let's get started. Kevin here is using his 2017 artwork as compared to the older artwork. Um, artwork that I think looked kind of weird at the time, but I think it looks fine now. You know what I think still looks weird though? Johnny Blamer's 2017 artwork. Uh, hopefully if Johnny is re-released, they use a different picture for him. Of course, the Dynaco logo there. You know what though? The original render for Johnny Blamer looks really weird too. Johnny Blamer is a weird character. His nickname, according to Meet the Cars, is Magnet Face, and he's never finished a race. Poor guy. Poor, poor guy. After the Johnny Go 400, a tiebreaker race is needed to determine the winner of the Piston Cup. We have all the racers going across there, um, including Dale Earnhardt Jr., which is interesting that they used a picture with him in it. Then we have Claude Scruggs, Billy Oil Changer, Splider, Slider, Petrolski, sorry and Sage Vanderspin, who unfortunately is, uh, they pulled a Bruce Miller and gave Sage Vanderspin the name and artwork for Rex Revler, unfortunately. Um, so that's a car I may actually pass on uh, if I find it, because I don't want to be like promoting the mistakes that they're making. There have been so many mistakes regarding the naming of the Cars when pissing up cars and confusing them with the ones from Cars 3. Um, and it's just unfortunate with, with Sage Vanderspin and Winford Bradford Rutherford getting not only the wrong name, but the wrong artwork as well. The opposite happened with Parker Brigston getting the artwork from Manny Flywheel. It's a mess. But hey, at least everything turned out okay with Kevin Shift right. That's a smooth transition right there. Let's get started with the review. He has a very nice dark blue color scheme compared to the racer that uh, came after him in Cars 3, Dino Drasky. You have the Clutch Aid Bandage logo there. Not as much of a bandage as it is on Dino Drasky though, but still green with the Clutch Aid logo, very nice. I like these white stripes that go all across him. I think it really helps him stand out amongst the Piston Cup racers. He has the number 121. Just got your typical expression here for a car of the Nitroade uh, model. And speaking of Nitroade, that is his first secondary sponsor, alongside the Piston Cup, Revolting, Mood Springs, Octane Gain, Vitaline, No Stall, Gaskets, Gasprin, Easy Idle, RPM, Little Turkey Pistons, Leakless, Retread, and Clutch Aid itself down there. Have his wheels there, looking pretty nice. We got the number 121, very interesting font with the numbers. The two almost looks like a Z. Got Clutch Aid on the back and a little bandage, uh, bandage at the bottom, which is a nice detail because they draw a line going under the band-aid to make it look like he was cut there and they put the bandage uh, bandage over it which is a pretty funny detail. Clutch Aid logo there and on the back where of course the white stripes continue. Clutch Aid once again on the back here no tagline or anything and just the same details even the bandage um, mirrored onto the other side. And there is the base Anyway guys, thank you all so much for watching. Kevin here is definitely a very nice looking Cars 1 Piston Cup racer. I really like the stripes and he's a unique shade of blue. So many Piston Cup cars are shades of blue. When I look at myself with my race cars on it, it's always just like there's a blue one, there's a blue one, there's a blue one, there's a blue one. But Kevin Shift Right is a very dark shade of blue, something that didn't carry over to Cars 3, where Dino Jurafsky was the same usual light blue everybody else is. And then Noah Gokek was green. Anyway guys, thank you all so much for watching. See you guys next time. Bye now.